what if you have data in a column like this and you need employee one and these numbers to be split into two cells? One quick and easy way is to go to data, text to columns. Now, text to columns could be fixed width or delimited. Delimited just means, hey, there's some character that will tell us how to split this data from a cell into multiple cells. So I click delimited, click next. I'm going to come to other, right? Lots of stuff comes, comma separated, tab separated. But look at this. I'm going to say other and type a dash. And no problem. Next, I can choose to format if I want or not here. But um, destination is an important consideration. A lot of time, you, you don't want the original data. So A2, that means it would replace all this. If you wanted to keep the data, then you could click in some uh, cell besides the default cell there, and then click Finish. Now, the only problem with this, and a lot of times, even I've done this over the years, I, I don't take notice. And then I try and do some data uh, analysis, and there's a space there that's causing trouble. So let's redo that. And notice that the delimiter there is there, but there's also a space that's causing some trouble. So I'm going to come to Data. The keyboard shortcut is Alt-A for Data, E for Text to Column, Alt-A-E. Delimited. I'm going to click Next. And here, I'm going to say, and you can watch the preview here, Space and uh, that uh, dash there. And then I'm just Next, not A10, but I'll put it. Uh, how about C10? And then click Finish. And now we don't have that space. All right, see you next trick.